Welcome back on board another video in the Bdeploy feature discovery series. Today we will have a look at YAML schemas and validation of YAML files using those schemas. In Bdeploy 5, we now finally provide schemas for all our YAML files. These can be accessed both through the CLI as well from a specified endpoint which is documented in the OpenAPI specification for the bdeploy public API. On the command line, the bdeploy schema tool can be used to list schemas, to generate schemas on the command line, and to generate schemas into files. and especially useful to validate files. If I now intentionally destroy this file by putting, say, a wrong type for this field, the validation will yield an error message hinting me to the problem. This feature becomes even more useful when coupled with a proper YAML editor. As you can see, the YAML language server supports a mode line to specify a remote schema. This is the schema URL that is supported by every bdeploy server. It will yield the currently valid schema for this type of file. The editor, when loading this schema, can now provide content assist, documentation and validation. As before, let's change the type to an invalid one and I will immediately receive the validation error. We do hope you enjoyed this video and see you in the next episode.